Anthony Tony Tersi, February 16, 1901, April 22, 1989, was an Italian-American organized crime figure associated with San Juan, Puerto Rico from the 1950s to the 1970s. Within the history of crime in Puerto Rico, he attracted notice primarily for owning the notable nightclub La Riviera. While his operations faced frequent interruptions by the Puerto Rican government, he managed to achieve success in the territory's underworld for many years. One particular raid, he later recalled, had involved the arrest of over 300 women by anti-vice officers. The farce, as he called it, of police raids wound up frightening prostitutes off of the streets and rebounding things in his favor, with Percy controlling his own established locations. Historian Stan Steiner labeled him as a nightclub impresario. La Riviera Tercy gained fame as the owner of the La Riviera, a nightclub in San Juan, Puerto Rico well known for its association with easy prostitution. A popular attraction for not only locals but also expatriates and tourists, La Riviera faced the danger of constant raids by the police, Though this didn't phase Tercy. In the 1970s, societal changes marked the decline of his club. Tercy would say, I'm going broke because people are now getting for free what we used to charge for. Tercy repeatedly rejected suggestions to turn La Riviera into an LGBT themed disco as he found the idea personally offensive. Tercy finally agreed to sell his nightclub to the government, which promptly demolished it. Politics Dursey also took interest in civic affairs. He ran unsuccessfully for mayor of San Juan as a political independent in 1968. His write in campaign used the simple slogan, Voter Poor Tercy. He also provided poor children with parties on Thanksgiving, Christmas, and Three Kings Day. Imprisonment in 1976. Tercy and his son Philip Tercy pleaded guilty to possessing 2,400 stolen blank tickets for Eastern Airlines. Part of the plea bargain deal involved granting youthful offender status and probation to Philip. On February 20, 1976, the court fined Anthony Tercy $5,000 and sentenced him to five years imprisonment to be served consecutively to a sentence in Puerto Rico. The court also sentenced fine Philip Tercy $5,000 and sentenced him to imprisonment of one year and one day. Anthony Tercy later appealed the verdict based on Philip's sentence, but the appeal was denied. Death He was released on November 30, 1979. Tercy then retired to Nevada, where he died on April 22, 1989. See also List of Puerto Ricans List of Crime Bosses References